Yesterday was really an incredible day, and today we continue to remember our dear friend Denise. Denise Asenzo would have actually been 62 years old today, and now January 30th, 2020 is officially Denise Asenzo Day here in Connecticut. Governor Ned Lamont made that announcement at that public memorial service yesterday. Tomorrow is uh, named after your mom. Tomorrow is your wife's day. And uh, we only celebrate three birthdays. You know, we got George Washington, we got Martin Luther King, and now we have Double D Day. For Denise DeCenzo, of course, uh, now to honor Denise. Uh, her family actually created a foundation to carry on her legacy and support efforts that were very important to her. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Eva Zamaris visited the place to be in Hartford, a restaurant now doing what they can to support the cause. It's a great way to honor someone we all saw every day. Good evening, everyone. I'm Denise DeCenzo. Gina Luari, like countless others, watched Denise DeCenzo on TV for years. It's so surreal not seeing her on the news. To honor Denise, her family started the Denise DeCenzo Foundation. Donations will support causes Denise was most passionate about. Advances in medicine and health, women's and children's issues, and journalism studies. When Gina, the owner of the place to be in Hartford, found out about the foundation, she knew she wanted to do something. I thought just doing today, since it is with me, Senzo Day, uh, having 20% of the proceeds go to the foundation would be great. But Gina didn't stop there. And if you can't make it here today, you can buy one of the specialty blue and white milkshakes that they'll be selling next week or a mimosa. And those proceeds will go directly to the Denise DeCenzo Foundation. It's a way to kind of get everyone to contribute in one way or another. While we were at the place to be, we spoke with people about Denise's legacy. And for so many years, we have watched her. You know, we all enjoyed her. And, you know, she's part of the uh, community. She was like an icon for the, not only for Hartford, you know, for the whole, whole state. They tell us the foundation is a perfect way to pay tribute to a woman who meant so much to so many people. That's her. I mean, she would be so proud. She's probably looking down and she's looking at what, what's being done for her in her name and just with a big smile on her face. She was always part of Channel 3 and always will be. In Hartford, Eva Zamaris, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. And that woman is exactly right, Eva. Thank you so much. Uh, you can watch the entire service from yesterday. It's posted right now on the Channel 3 app and WFSB.com. You will also find a link there to the Denise DeCenzo Foundation.